It's time for baseball now as the show's tour of the minors continues with a stop in the Southern League. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Tennessee Smokies and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. Stepping in, Roberto Caro, and we are set for baseball here this evening. 3-2 pitch. Now a hard liner. But this will be a foul ball. Temperature reading an even 80 degrees at first pitch tonight. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. And he'll take this to the bag himself. And there's your first out of the ball game. Stepping up to the plate, Zach Davis. He went hitless last night in a game where his guys could push across only one score. Here's a pop up now. Wise waits on it. And that's the second out of the inning. Ready now, Ian Rice. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Two out, nobody on. Hit on the ground to third. Scooped up. Throw to first in plenty of time, and his side is retired. Now at the plate, Zane Gerwitz. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 1 1. Is looked at for ball number two. Line drive to left. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. The throw is wild and it gets away. Into the box, Keaton Weiss. In the air, down the line and left. Left fielder is on the move. And he makes the catch in the corner. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. That is good. At the plate, the Bo Way comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. The 2 1. Takes a pitch for strike number two. Not the ideal location for a changeup up in the zone, but he got away with it. Struck him out. And now they'll likely need a base hit to get that runner home from third. Now with the plate, Jordan Zimmerman. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. And this pitcher's feeling the flow right now. Two outs in the first inning. He's got really nice mechanics working right now. Blew that fastball right by him. Two and two the count. Two and two. Here it is. Men on third with two down. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Second inning set to go, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Christopher Morrell. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. That's good. The center fielder, Brandon Beaver. In now, Brennan Davis. And he'll try to hold back the swing, but he'll do so unsuccessfully as that's ruled a strike. Up to two balls and two strikes now. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. Popped up. Kruger has a play, and that's the first out of the inning. Stepping up now, Jose Gutierrez. He'll get to take his first cuts here. No score here as we play inning number two. Up 
up and in on the hands. It's two balls and a strike. Popped up. Wise camps under it, and he's got it for route number two. Into the box now, that's Trench that's and Brony, and he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. Here's the one-two, and he lays off the pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. And he misses with that one down and in. It's a full count now, three and two. Some pitchers fall into the trap of giving in on three and two because they don't want to walk the guy. But with the base open, it's not the end of the world if you do. You still need to make a quality pitch. The first base so striding forward now, Alfonso Rivas. It was a two-head effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. Three and one. Call didn't go his way on two and one, but it's important here on three and one to still make a quality pitch. You have to have the mindset that you're still the one in the driver's seat. Three and two, full count. Ready with the payoff pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. He's right there, and the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Stepping into the box, Joey Curletta took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. Into center field, line drive base hit. So now to the plate, Connor Justice. High in the air and deep to left center field. A ball that's carrying. And just short of a home run, this ball's off the wall. At the plate, Johan Arena. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And it's two balls and two strikes now. He must have been sitting fastball right there because he is not going to see a better pitch tonight. He cannot let that hanger go. Fouled off. Now another 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. So coming to the plate, Edwin Young. He drove in one of their two runs in last night's ball game. And here's the 3-2 from him. Liner towards second, but right to the second baseman, and that's the second out. Standing in now with runners in scoring position, Jack Cougar. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. The set and the 1-1. One, one. And he fouls this one off. Struck him out. So they work out of the jam as he strands two men in scoring position. Late now, Arama Sadiman, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. 1-1. One, one. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Way is there, and he has it for the first out. So stepping in, Roberto Caro. He got on top of one. It was a ground out victim last time. 
Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. Throw gets him two down. Into the box now, Zach Davis. 0 for 1 here in the early going. The 1-1. One, one. It's a fastball that misses. This year against right-handed pitching, Davis carries a hitting line just over the 280 plateau. Line towards center field. Way will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Ready for another chance? Zane Gerwitz. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Into the box. Stop Keaton White flied out in his Stop. first at-bat, so Keep make him 0 for 1 so far. The 1-1. Lifted in the air to straightaway center. Davis is there now, and he has it to God. At the plate, Bo Way. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. A shot to first base and caught there to end the inning. Riding in once again, Ian Rice. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Here's the 1 and 1 delivery. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. Digging in, Christopher Morrell. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. And that's been their only hit so far in this one. They've been dealing with some really great pitching in this game. There's a line drive out toward the gap in right center. He's through first and hustling for second. And he'll pull into second with one away. Now back. The Fetter Fielder. Brandon Hoover. Standing in now, Brennan Davis. And it's fouled away. Pitching has the upper hand early as we're scoreless in inning number four. Line drive to center field. Catch made in straightaway center as the runner tags from second. And he's up to third safely now with two gone in the inning. Next will be the designated hitter, Jose Gutierrez. Runner in scoring position with two gone. Gutierrez. Payoff pitch. Hit in the air down the left field line. And this will fall, but it's a foul ball. He set the payoff pitch. Line to the right side. Curletta is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And set to go as the third baseman, Jordan Zimmerman. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. The one-two. Misses, ball two. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. The 2 2 one more time. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. Well, that sets up a big pitch right here, Matt, because you don't want to lose the leadoff guy in a scoreless game. It's tough to work around the leadoff walk. And that misses for ball four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. Good 
he takes strike three called on the fastball. One gone. Striding forward now is the D.H. Connor Justice, one for one, as he reached base with a double his first time up. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode a lot. Of and the throw to first is there. The inning is over. Digging in now, Trent Jimbroni reached base via the walk in his first plate appearance. Swung on and hit pretty well out to deep left field. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And he will pull into second with a leadoff double. The first base, number 17, Alfonso Luba. To the plate now, Alfonso Rivas. Hit out towards second. He's got it. Throw to first is in time for the first down. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Arama Sadiman. He flew out in his last at bat. Yeah, give me the same at bat. As you stride to the plate right here, give me the same execution. Just get something in the air. Meanwhile, this ball gets down. It's a base hit. The runner from third crosses the plate, and they've taken a 1 0 lead. Now back, right fielder, Roberto Caro. At the plate now, Roberto Caro. There's one that misses inside, and the count's run full now, three and two. Got to execute a good pitch right here. Runner at first is probably going to be on the move, and you've got one of the better hitters on their team up at the plate. Well, this is pulled in by the shortstop. Ready now once back. again, Zach Davis. He's popped Zach. out and lined out, 0 for Davis. 2 thus far. Line drive to left. And that'll get down for a base hit. The catcher, number 13, Ian Wright. Stepping in now, Ian Rice. Slapped hard the opposite way. And he'll get there in plenty of time. This one away, and that ends the inning. Digging in the switch hitter, Johan Arena. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. And you can live with punching out with the bases empty, but in his last at bat with two runners in scoring position, you cannot go down not putting the ball in play. Too much on the line, too many ribby opportunities out there to swing and miss in that spot. Davis comes on now, and he has it one down. Now back. Now at the plate, Edwin Young hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the result sometimes, Matty. Just unlucky with the placement. And a curveball is by him that time as he falls behind now one and two. To two balls and two strikes now. He might have to look for a different way to put this guy away on 2-2. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times, so he might be looking for it. Fouled away. Bases are empty, one man out. Not close with the off-speed pitch taken for a ball. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Davis is in his tracks now. And there's the second out of the inning. Digging in, Jack Kruger looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Trying to send him packing for the second time. Sliced hard on the ground, right to him. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Jose Rodriguez takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. For the track pandas, number 63. Striding in, Christopher Morrell. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Here now the 2-2. Doesn't get the zone. Count full now. Popped him up. 
twice. Stay with it as he backs up and puts it away. One gone. Now batting. Coming to the plate now, Brennan Davis. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. 1 and 1, here it is. Grounder down the line at third. But this will get fouled. It's a ball and two strikes. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Smoked on the ground up the middle. And that'll find its way into center field for a one out hit. Now back. Designated hitter. And now Jose Gutierrez. Misses ball two. Line to the right side. Curletta is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Digging in and looking for more, Trent Jimbroni. He came across to score after doubling in his last at bat. Yeah, give me a repeat performance of that last double. With a man on first right now, let him run, get you a ribby. Hit down the third baseline, but this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Throw over to first. And he'll dive back in safely. Skied into straightaway right. Curletta is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Zane Gerwitz, one for two with a double on his line thus far. Back up the middle. Throw gets him at first, and I'll tell you what, they don't come much better than what you saw right there. Now batting, Keaton White. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Changed up on him as this is grounded a second. Reined in. Throw in time at first for route number two. Now with the play. Oh, yeah, way. Oh, for two for him to this point. The 1 1 home. Hit hard up the middle. And there's his first base hit in this one. At the plate, Jordan Zimmerman. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. Popped up. Rivas in foul ground. No trouble with this one. And the inning is over. Settling in now, Alfonso Rivas will start the seventh in what's been a fast-moving pitcher's duel to date. The 2-1. Heading out towards shallow right. Curletta has the best view of this one, so he'll take it for the first out. Standing in, Aramis Ademan. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Ademan. Fouled off. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. Breaking ball. Called third strike as that catches the zone for route number two. Now batting. Now to the plate, plate. Roberto Caro. He could really use a knock oh. here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. The 
the 1-1 home. Swing and a ball line hard towards short. And that'll get down for a two-out single. Now back the left field. Back. Into the box now. Zach Davis. Strike called. Now the throw down. Is well behind the play. That's an easy stolen base. This one is fouled away up to the concourse area. Man, he's going to be kicking himself when he goes and watches the video after this one. That's a change up. Two strikes in the wheelhouse. You cannot miss that pitch. Scooped up. And the stolen base winds up as a moot point as the inning is over. Now in the box, Joey Curletta. He's one for two in this one. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Count even at two and two. Pitch on the way. Rounded weakly to the left. Fielded cleanly. One away. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Connor Justice. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, rolling into a two ball will eat at you for the rest of the game at least. So you know he wants to make up for it right here. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Now back, first baseman, Oh, great job. Get back up the middle. Oh, what a stop. The throw to first. Not in time. Exceptional effort out there, but that base hit puts the potential tying run at first. Craig Brooks is on his way into the ballgame now as he'll be making his 50th appearance of the year. Standing in now, Edwin Young. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. And that's in there. Base hit. Fortunately for him, though, no error on the bobble, and the runners will hold it first and second now. At the plate now, Jack Kruger. And he misses two and one. Brooks. A 27-year-old, he throws a four-seam fastball, a slider, a changeup, and a two-seam fastball. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Long throw to the plate. He's safe. The throw was offline. It's a big two-out hit, and that ties the ball game. The batter number 19, second baseman, Dave. Into the box, Zane Gerwitz. Fastball hit on the ground is short. He's right there. Throw to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Kyle Keller has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 68. At the plate, Ian Rice hit the ball pretty well in his last at bat, but it resulted in a line out. Yeah, Maddie, it's always a little frustrating when you square one up. You hit a solid line drive like he did, and all you have a dive, and he knocks it down. On the recovery throw is in time to get the out at first. What a heads-up play. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Christopher Morrell. He's two for three and looking for more here. The 1-1 home. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Way is there two gone. So digging in now, Brennan Davis. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. All even now, two and two. This one misses, and that'll fill the count here. Three and two with two away. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So got him looking, and that'll do it. The inning is over.
bottom of inning number eight set to go. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Keaton Weiss. A one one. Fastball called strike three, and there's the first out of the inning. Digging in, Way. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Fastball just inside. Jordan Zimmerman waits on deck. Line towards center field. And he'll lay out to make a spectacular catch. Wow. Digging in to try it again. Jordan Zimmerman. 0 for 2 with a walk for him so far. The set and the 1-1. Right down the shoot that time. 1 and 2. To two balls and two strikes now. Down the third baseline. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. Two and two. Here it is. Now a ball lined to the left side. But this is a foul ball. Got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts an end to the inning. All set to start the ninth in this one, and striding forward the designated hitter, Jose Gutierrez. The one-two. Still a ball and two strikes. Here's another one, two. And he popped him up. Zimmerman has room in foul territory. He dives, but he can't make the catch. It's a foul ball. He'll try again, one, two. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Tough to take a pitch like that right there, especially in a one-two count. You almost get in that auto swing mode. Great job to work the count back to even. Full count now. Four foul balls in this A-B. Pitcher cannot find anywhere to go to put this guy away. All right, pitch number 10 is the one that finally does it as he strikes out after a long battle here. The second one out, nobody on. Right. Well hit to right, but a foul ball. Ball two. These last two guys are making him work quite a bit out there. Both have been long at bats, and all in all, he's had to make 13 throws just to them so far. And he fouls this one off. A slider in there for a called third strike, and there are two gone now. The first Ready for another Alfonso shot now. Alfonso, Alfonso Rivas. Rivas. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. And a good spot for that pitch is it's chopped foul. fouled away way inside with that one a pretty easy take there for the guy in the mound this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy and he goes the other way as this is hit high and deep out to straightaway left now this will rattle up against the wall 
And your go-ahead run is in there at second base as he's got himself a two-out double. Simon Matthews has been summoned here and will try to keep this one tied heading to the bottom of the ninth. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Crash Bandles, number six. To the plate now, Arama Sadiman. Flare out toward right center. Gerwitz ranging into the outfield. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Dylan Maples enters to do the pitching, and best case scenario for him is to push this one into extra innings. Bottom of the inning now, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Joey Curletta. Now the one and one pitch is taken for ball two. Hasn't seen a heater yet in this at bat. One might be coming right here. Taken, strike two called, and it's even at two and two. Now here's the pitch. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. Wow, talk about a waste pitch on two and two. That one wasn't even close. I don't know anyone that would have swung at that pitch. A drive to left. Get out of here. Get out of here. Gone. They win it. Santa Maria. They say better late than never, and that's obviously something that he takes to heart as he puts a charge in one for a walk-off homer. Got to be the best feeling in all of baseball. Not a lot of runs put on the board in this one, but here's a guy that found a way to make a difference. He's the top's player of the game. Multi-hit game, and one of them was a dinger. That's a solid day's work for any hitter, and it had an impact on the outcome of this game. What else can you say? Close one tonight, 2-1 to one, the final score. Rocket City came through and it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Simon Matthews gets the win in relief, his sixth of the season. So that'll just about do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out the ShowNation.com. The for our ball game, for the victorious draft two runs on eight hits. No air, but they left seven men on base. For the Smokies, one run, eight hits. No air, they left eight men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 40 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please drive home safely.